for visiting svgcuts.com slash blog. In this video tutorial, we're going to show you how to make your newly installed fonts appear or just give you some troubleshooting techniques in case you're not seeing the new fonts that you installed. We already have video tutorials that show you how to install new fonts for both Windows XP and Windows Vista. We'll go ahead and post the links here. So if you're trying to learn how to install them, you want to check those videos out. Now if you've already installed them and you're, you're having a hard time getting them to show up, this video is for you. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go under the edit option and go under preferences. And under preferences, you want to make sure that this use full font scan option is checked. Okay, I think by default it is not checked. So you want to make sure that it's checked and then you're going to hit OK. Okay, now once you have that new font installed, some people for some reason believe that it might show up here under the shapes library. That's not the case. Okay, in order to see those new fonts, you click on tools and you click on the type tool here. And this is the list of fonts that are currently installed. Okay, so if you've installed the new font and it's not showing up in this list, two things you can do. One, we already showed you and you do the edit preferences and then you click on this use full font scan option and hit OK. And then also what you can do is if you have not closed shortcuts a lot and reopened it after installing the new font, you can click on this reload the fonts option. This is like a refresh button, okay? And that's gonna rescan your fonts folder to find the new font. And worst case scenario, if you've already tried this reload button and you've already tried to go under preferences and check the box that's labeled use full font scan, you can just close shortcuts a lot and then just reopen it. And that's, that's also going to force the program to try to locate those new fonts. Um, if they're still not showing up, either A, you've got them in the wrong place, or you're going to try to have to reinstall them one more time. Just go over and, and look at that video again. Or that font that you're trying to install is corrupt or damaged or is not compatible. Um, but that's really it. That those, those are the only things that can really occur um, as far as fonts go. But the most important thing is just to make sure that you're looking under the font option here in the properties window. And you'll only see that if I have this type tool selected. If you have the selection tool selected, you're not going to see your fonts. Okay, so you only see the fonts when you're in the type tool mode. Okay, and as you can see, there they are. All right, so if you have any questions regarding this tutorial or anything else, feel free to use the contact form on our website. That's at www.svgcuts.com blog.